So um, thanks everyone for joining me. Um, basically, we're going to go into an overview of SUSE Cloud, uh, which is based on OpenStack Havana and, um, and our high, abil high availability portion. Uh, this is our de deployment framework so that you can easily deploy the components of OpenStack. We've incorporated Pacemaker and CurlSync into the equation so that we can have a highly available um, controller node. So this is not your live migration between, between compute nodes. This is for your controller node. Um, we start by creating a pacemaker cluster, and we can choose the method of um, for, for an SBD device or um, different mechanisms to configure the cluster for internal communication. In this scenario, we are using an SBD device with Dev um, SDC, which is our uh, split brain. Uh, device for the spleen de brain detection. Um, and we're enabling DRDV for certain components uh, like RabbitMQ or uh, MySQL. And we're also um, making available the old style HB GUI interface for, um, for, for uh, Pacemaker. Um, we can then easily choose our known servers, which in this case, we have a two-node cluster. Um, and then we pretty much apply the proposal to deploy our um, pacemaker cluster. Moving, moving forward, the database. Uh, in this scenario, we selected high availability uh, using DRDB. We're using uh, one gigabyte as this is storage for now, because it's, it's just a demo. Normally, uh, depending on, on your environment, you may want to have uh, 10, 8, 15, or 20 gigabytes here. The end result, as we start creating these components into, into, um, into Pacemaker, is what we show here in Hawk. We can see all the resources for Neutron, Glance, RabbitMQ, Keystone, uh, pretty much uh, every single uh, resource out there. Uh, what's missing here to deploy is uh, Horizon. So we will have a session Thursday afternoon, hands-on session on how to do this from zero to full deployments. So if you want to join that session, we will gladly ha have you there. Um, so part of, the, uh, part of the value here, of course, of having a high availability is you can do a, um, it, you can do migration of the resource if you want to migrate, let's say, from um, upgrade from Havana to Icehouse, so you can have one node in that um, and, and, and up, be upgraded on a different version of, uh, of OpenStack and then fail over again to that node. So there are a lot of use cases, and of course, eliminating the single point of failure, which is uh, the, the main goal here. Um, and let me see what else I can show you here. We can create a horizon proposal. Oh, just a moment. I'll get back to um, Keystone action. So this is um, this is part of the, of the uh, configuration for Keystone. And we can configure the default values, assign the, the component 
to the cluster we created with Pacemaker, and our developers have made um, uh, pretty much the process so that both components will get installed in each um, node of the cluster, uh, yet the resource is obviously uh, in, in, in one of the, the nodes. It would be the active node. We can see that in Hawk specifically. Okay, so this is pretty much what we wanted to show today. Um, for a full hands-on demo, please visit us on, on Thursday afternoon. You will need some files. Uh, you can get them at our booth from tomorrow on. And um, if you have any questions, we're right in the booth and I'll be around the area.